Hey everybody, my name's Ryan. You're watching Buff Family Sports, and it's finally arrived. Collector booster box that I ordered, pre-ordered through Amazon. Uh, pretty decent price. And uh, came in, and now it's, uh, it's time to go to work. We got work to do. We got 12 packs to open here. Uh, 12 packs, 15 cards per pack, something like that. Uh, we're on the Expedition Land Hunt. Try to get, oh, there's, that's right, there's two Expedition Land cards here, okay. And then uh, we have a 17% chance, which I think is roughly one in five and a half packs of cards, something like that, <clears throat> to see if we can get some more foil Expedition Lands. Cavern of Souls, or whatever. So, uh, we'll set those right there. And I'm gonna start the right side today. See how we get, what we get. Or, okay, well, we got a foil borderless land on this one. So we got five commons. We should have two uncommons, there's our land. Okay, starting off with a Full Earth, a borderless mythic, very nice. Rolling vortex for the foil rare, nice. One, two, fill it our retreat for the rare. And then there's a McKinney ox. And then there's our, look at that, that's gorgeous. Full art, borderless, rare. So um, we'll do it like this, okay. So regular rare, whatever, whatever. Okay, not a bad little pack. Right out the gate like that, coming out with that beautiful riverglide pathway. Second pack. Rapid bite. Five. That's right. Oh man, it's got a real bad case of tinnitus. That hurts. Legion Angel. There's a Shatter Skull Charger. Got, and then, oh, look at that clear water pathway again. And then there's a Brush Fire Elemental for that. Oh, and there it is, Misty Rainforest. Look at that, beautiful. Oh, you're gorgeous. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Our first expedition land. That's gorgeous, and I think, yeah, there's a, yeah, there, okay. So, put that guy right there. Misty Rainforest. Or should I put it over here with the, now we'll leave it right there in the end. So that's one out of two. What do we got here? One, two, three, four, five. There's a Kite Sail Cleric, and there's a Foil Base Camp. Myriad Construct. Oh, there's a River Glide Pathway Foil Rare right there. One and two. Oh, Morog, Fury of Akum. Mythic Alternate Art. Very nice. Put them with, uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll put them over here. Dead Worm, and then there's a Thieving Skydiver, and that is the Box Topper. Star right there, that Borderless Foil. Very pretty. Put it over there. And then Dreadworm. Uh, right there. All right. So our first box topper esque foily borderless card. Five. Two. There's a Plains. Master of Winds. Not bad. Nimble Trap Finder. Not bad. Spitfire Lagok. And there's the Needle Verge Pathway for that one. Have another Prowling Feldar, and then there's another box topper, the Akiri Fearless Voyager. Cool. That's, uh, where am I putting these? I want to keep them over here. I'll put them right there. All right, so we are approaching the halfway point. Doesn't take long with these, does it? Anticognition, starting it off. Yep. Let's see. There's a 
Forced. There's a, another Fearless Voyager. We got the non-foil version that time. A Scoot Worm. Canopy Dreadworm. And then there's Valakut Exploration. And that is the alternate rare. And then there's another Inscription of Abundance for the foily goodness. All right, last pack on the right side. Let's see, how's it gonna, how's it gonna end here, Scorch? Just so much space. There's our two, nice mountain. Oh, nice, Velocut Awakening, followed by uh, the foily version of Velocut Awakening. Okay, Spitfire, Brushfire. There's a river glide, canopy valleth, and ah, oh, nice, another spire garden. It's our second spire garden. Twenty dollar card, not one hundred and fifty. I was way off. And we'll put that guy there. Put that guy there. Okay, that's a nice way to end up. If we started from the left, it'd be a nice way to end the box. But uh, I had to do things differently. There's a goblin construct in the back there. Okay. Fort the Grave, Shatter Skull Minotaur, there's a Forest, there's Zareth San, the Trickster, Thieving Skydiver, Dreadworm, there's a Bright Pet Climb Pathway, the Spitfire Lagok, and then there's Kaza Royal Chaser, so that's, what, like four already for those. Okay. And let's keep going. See, will we get at least one more? Remember, it's a 17% chance. Roughly one in five and a half percent or so. Torborax, Hope's Demise. Nice. Nahiri's Lithoforming. Okay. Oh, there's a Jace Mirror Mage, and that's the Mythic Borderless right there. Nice. Oh, oh, and there's a... Cavern of Souls, nice, very nice. Cavern of Souls, Mythic, Expedition Land, Art Card, Foily Goodness. There, that's what I was talking about. That's what I wanted to see. Nice box. Three, four, five. Two. Okay, you got a swamp. There is a timber, turn timber symbiosis. Nice mythic. There's a magmatic channeler for the rare. Cousin do rune crab, and then a branch loft pathway. Followed by rune crab, and then a coveted prize. Nice. Look at that. We'll uh, put you there, and put both of you guys there, and then there's that. So it seems to me like there's a little bit more value in uh, these packs. It's, uh, I think, a fifth borderless uh, foil. Usually you only get four. Five. Cineclasm two. Let's do a little house cleaning here. Oh, hurry up. Get to the card. What's next? i got to get my fix. An island. There's a crag plate ballot. Interesting. And then a coveted prize, a Coom Hellhound, Dreadworm. There's a Crag Crown Pathway, followed by a Canopy Belt, and a Felidar Retreat for that back end rare. Felidar Retreat, and then the Balath, or Crag Crown Pathway. There we go. All right, down to our last two packs. Man, this one is, does not take long for this party. Come to a close. Why are you difficult? Interesting. There we go. Highborn Vampire. Rolling Balagad. They're both greens. Balagad Recovery and then Balagad Sanctuary. Plains. Oh, Kaza Royal Chaser. There's a Lotus Cobra foil. Not bad. Canopy Valve, Skyclave, and then there's a Skyclave Shade. For the in there, and then oh, another there's like that foil, Nahiri's lithoforming. Oh, wait, wrong one. You go there. 
And then you go there, and then you go there. Okay, last pack. Then we'll get into the box toppers. Are we gonna get one more? One more? Ooh, that's a pretty good sign. Let's see, what are we gonna get? One more expedition card. There's a forest. There's a thieving skydiver. Shadows Verdict. Kendi Ox. Territorial Scythe Cat. Kazandu Mammoth. Yeah. Skyclave. And then a Myriad Construct to end it out. Oh, well. Hey, we still pulled three Foil Expedition lands. And then we'll put that guy right there. It's like our fifth or sixth. Uh... Uh, what was it a borderless box toppery? Yeah. All right, let's see what's this one going to be here. Number one of two. It's going to be Creeping Tar Pit. Yeah, that's terrifying. And then our second one. What's it going to be? I guess we'll do it this way. Since it's just a single solitary card. Here we go. Huh. Celestial Colonnade. Okay. So there we go. Five. Three of them being foil. Two of them being not. And there's our commons. There's the uncommons. There's all the lands. There's the showcases. Let's get into this guy here, because I think we got six. Let's see, Myriad Construct, Nahari's Lithoforming. There's a couple of lands, Coveted Prize. There's another land, there's another. I'll tell you what, we'll move these over. Riverglide, Inscription, Akiri, Needle Verge. Look at that, Thieving, and uh, I'm gonna put that one down there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven of the borderless foils. And then, uh, we got all these lands here Riverglide Pathway for a foil land, Clearwater, Needle Verge, another Riverglide, Bright Climb, Crag Crown, which I think is different, and then Branch Loft. Okay. Then here's our non-foil. One mythic. There's a Jace, two mythics. And I think we start off with a mythic. Yep, does it beacon of unity? For the oh goodness. Here are the there's a foily one. There's another mythic. So only one foil rare border uh, showcase. Cool. All right, that's it. I'm Ryan. You've been watching Buck Family Sports. Peace.